going, Richard? Oh, good. The millennials are here. So check it out. I got a uh, killer deal uh, late last night on the old interwebs, and we're going to go pick it up. Uh, I think it's pretty bitching. Uh, it's a 1980 Blazer K5, uh, and it's in original black, red interior, white half top. Uh, it should be pretty wicked. Uh, it needs a little restoration and stuff like that, but this one actually runs and drives. And it's only 60 miles from Dallas, so let's grab our water because we're driving. Millennials unite! Let's go! We're going to Campbell, Texas. I don't know. <laughs> uh, let's see. One hour and ten minutes. Hey, quit standing there and get in the car, man. We gotta go. Come on. Here, 52, blankety blank. Can't tell you all these numbers. Where are we at? Little short bed steps out of there. Not bad. Gonna be on the left. Bet it might be that big old building right there. Come out here, you get a lot of a lot of dough for your dough, or a lot of a lot of money land. I don't know, land, cattle, whatever's, whatever. This is a double entry. Uh, yeah, looks like it. Everything sure. If not, if not, we'll make it in. Oh, look at that. He's still trying to get it running. <laughs> he said they cut the front fenders. Um, and the and the hood has been has that crease in it like they always do. Yeah, that's not a big deal. Simply blessed weddings and events. Yeah, my buddy does something like this at back up where I used to live. In one of these barn dominiums? Yeah, barn. He's got like, uh, I think it's probably 20,000 square feet now. They do a bunch of weddings and different venues and shit like that. Simply blessed wedding and events. Let's go talk to this guy about a blazer. Hi, man. This is it. This is something I'm very well versed at, son. Uh, this is a wedding and uh, event space. I've been married quite a few times. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you've, uh, you've been here or been in one of these more than I have. Oh, yeah. What's going, going on, sir? On. How are you doing? I'm Shane. Shane, what's happening, man? Nice to meet so you. So this is a blazer we talked about? Yes, sir. Cool, cool, cool. No. What, do, what do we know about it? It was a one owner for a little while, about 30 years up there in Sweetwater. I picked it up not long ago, and he just used it to pull his boat in and out of the lake. And uh, we bought it to restore, and we just hadn't had time. We have a lot going. Yeah, it looks like it. It's so new here. Uh, yeah, that's Wichita Falls. Oh. That's great. That's yeah, just a local truck. Well, as we say here in Texas, that's just down the road a piece. That's super cool. Door jams. I like it because it's the only one with that hood that year, that Is 80. this primer or did it used to be red? That's primer. Yeah, that's what I thought too. Yeah, that's the factory red primer. Factory primer on it. Well, you know, I got to say that's one of the better jobs of cutting fenders I've seen. <laughs> at least from this far away. Because yeah. yeah. at least they put the trim back on it and kind of tried to make try it look to hide right. it. Yeah. Does it run drive? Yeah. Let's see, it's under there. Oh, it is? Yeah, it's that old style. It's just the old 350 in it. Power steering, power brakes. Looks like it's an AC truck. Yeah, it was AC yeah, it was with that. cruise. It had cruise control. And uh, that was hooked up, he said. Um, he just, the compressor locked up and he took it out. You think this truck's been painted? I don't know, it's awfully rough if it had been. That, 
I know the top had been painted because it used to be white. There's a black and white in the old pictures he showed me. Uh-huh. Yeah, you can see the white yeah, here. Yeah, you see the white. How's the floorboards and stuff look, Chase? Not too, too bad. A little, little better than the rest of the normal spots, but nothing like we normally see. I'm almost too old to get down here, but I'm going to try it. <laughs> now it's, a, now it's, it's original color. Yeah, he says original How are you black. That, Chase? So if you peel back the floor, a lot of people won't just, they just won't paint the floor. So, but this floor is actually painted black, like the truck would have been. Hurry up, millennial. Get down here while I'm on my knees. I can't see. I can't get up. <laughs> oh, you're comfortable down. Need those young knees. I'm going to need help. I need help getting up. Where's the life, where's life alert when you need it? Yeah, I know, right? <sighs> I figure it's black because the, the gauge, the dash. I knew they could have painted it, but inside it was all black when you move the ashtray. Right on. Can you fire it up? Uh, yeah, we'll just uh, boost it. Do whatever you got to do. Give it a little help. What are you trying to find, Jason? Just looking at leaks and making sure the frame's not cracked or anything. Nothing crazy. Which it looks fine. Somebody had something welded there at one point, but. I sure wish they hadn't cut those front fenders. Yeah, those are those are dab a dozen, man. Yeah, but in factory paint. This is true. I didn't see any rust on my side. Did you see any actual just, rust through? Yeah, just a little bit of rust on the where the rocker meets the okay. meets the floorboard. But I mean that's fixable. You don't have to replace it. Nah, no, nah, no. Nah. It's a section about a quarter inch. He's gonna jump it off. I guess the battery's dead. It's clean though. It's really clean. Interior, Looks like somebody man. tried at one time to refurb the door panels over there. Painted, yeah, painted them with that plastic red paint. Yeah, Never works. Sorry if you produce plastic red paint. Gas is all right, it's a little old, but. Medium. Now this wouldn't be the Silverado. So this is the same as a Cheyenne earlier, right? Uh, no, it's a one step under a Cheyenne, if I'm not Oh, so mistaken. they still made Cheyennes in this? Yeah. Okay. They did a custom deluxe, a Silverado, and a Cheyenne. Believe. Don't quote me on that. Hey, call me for sure. Yeah, they'll, 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 they'll let me know. They'll yeah, let yeah, me know yeah. If I'm wrong. You internet uh, experts, uh, make sure you tell us what we're looking at. Wow. All right. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Getting cheaper on. What is that? It's an electric back glass. If that, if that works, it's all the money right Does there. it work? Yeah, it does. Has it got any rust in the tailgate? I don't know. We'll find out. Here you go. Do whatever you got to do. Sounds like a Texas truck. Yeah. That, that never works. So the handles will be right here. Yeah, that's black. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. And none of this is all rusted. And the, the seal plate's not all destroyed either. You've got a perfectly damn good flash water in there. <laughs> there you go. And, and, a, and, and a rock to throw that's at somebody if they messing with you. That's hey, awesome. maybe that's how your window got broken. <laughs> too soon. It's too soon. Will she go up and down the road? Yeah, she did. Been sitting up a while, but he'll drive up there. I drove it the other day. Yeah, let us go kick it through the gears. All right. Better put your seatbelt on. I ain't got much brake pedal at all. Great. I don't have a seatbelt back there, so let's see how that goes. Uh, well, millennials are uh, expendable. We don't really care until we need you. So you need to figure out your phone. Yeah, right? <laughs> Got that sticky, sticky, icky on oh. there. I don't want to hit this tree and scratch it. Oh, this electric window works. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. We didn't quite make it, did we? Battery's not too bad. Just holding the flooring cleared out. It was running a little rich when I was back there. Some of that fancy two footing. Not too close over there? No, you're right. All right. Wind works. Well, I mean, whoever buys it from 
us is gonna totally restore it or do something with it. So, right. You know, as long as it's all there, which is pretty cool. You know, bucket seat console. Yeah, bucket seat console truck. I just like the the color combination. Uh, you know, black and, black red, and red with a white top. You know, right. this was a good looking truck when it was made. For sure. Yeah, I think you, I think even if we just did a quick quick buff on it. Well, he's asking like twelve grand, which. I think it's all right if we needed it, but if we're just gonna flip it, get it cleaned up a little bit, get it running a little better. Yeah, uh, our buddy Sean sold his two weeks ago for 15, so they're bringing pretty good money. Oh yeah. I think his was a little bit better than this, but I don't know. Well, we can stick fifths on something like this, give them a day. Clean it up real to, good. Uh, tune it up, rebuild the carburetor, and then uh, just be done. Uh, tell the story. It definitely drives like an old blazer. Trying to, to be back here. Trying to find a place to turn around. You know, if I trusted it, I'd just jump off the curbs and shit here, but I don't think I trust it that much. Uh, I thought you said pedal goes to the floor. Oh, they'll shutter in reverse. No, that was the brake or the uh, the brakes letting off. I think, or not the brakes, the power steering. Oh, we off roading now. Getting crazy. <laughs> Woo! That steering wheel's putting up all the juice right now. Back in '80, you know, you could probably be riding back here drinking a cold course and not have to worry about a damn thing. They ain't got to worry about nothing. We need to see if we can get this thing closer to about eight grand. Yeah, I think that's more on the money. 7,500 be cool. You know, Dave Hall up at Restore Muscle Car, he is crushing it. He's doing more Blazers right now than he is Trans Ams and Camaros. Really? Freaking crushing it on these things. Should have let you drive. It's got all this sticky stuff, man. No, no, I'm okay. I hate it when these steering wheels do that. And there ain't no way to stop it after it starts. No. Once it starts, it's over with. Come on out here in the country and get married. If I'd have known this, I'd have brought Cap. We could have renewed our vows. Shit. Played a country song and everything. <laughs> right here on the back of this old blazer. That's right. Look, they got a little, little pond and all that stuff. I'm going to be uh, optimistic and go ahead and line it up at the trailer here. Okay. Let's go see what we can get done. Oh, man. Oh, you wanted to get out? Yeah. All right. I don't want to, I don't really want to give uh, 12. I damn sure don't want to give, I hope I don't have to give 10. What will it take today? Heck it is, I mean, because it needs a lot of stuff, but it, it is all there. Well, let's let's do eight and go drink a beer. Or you want to flip them? I don't, I don't need, are we flipping for the beer or are we flipping for the eight grand? Well, f no, we'll flip for the beer. <laughs> or you know, we'll do, are you going to do a, a thousand eight? You know what, fuck it, I'm going to do it. All right, let's do it. Eight or seven. We'll do that. Okay, now that's better. <laughs> All right, let's do it. There's let's do it. You gonna flip it? Yeah, yeah, I'll let you flip it. All right, you, you call calling? It. Yeah, I'll call heads. Uh, you already calling it? Yeah. Heads. You don't even know which way I'm gonna flip it. Let me make sure it's not double sided. That's a double sided. Oh, no. here we go. All right. <laughs> you ready? It's going for that heads. What is it? Oh, it's tails. You got me. There, got me. Man, that's a that's a quick one. There's your quarter. All right, thank you. All right, we got a deal, man. We got a deal. Appreciate it. Hey, Chase, get that thing loaded up. He's told me I could have a beer, so you're driving home. <laughs> well, it looks like there's more stuff in there. You, know, you want to come see the other stuff? Yeah, we'll come see the other stuff. We, we may come back for that one. Yes, yeah, this number matching 454. What? Shoot. Yeah. Come on in. I knew you. I saw some shiny. What's back here? No, that's a Bronco. Bronco. This is a 78 we picked up. We was going to restore. Who did this? Because that wasn't stock. That wasn't stock. The other no, owner did it. Did he that. painted that on the... Is this really drive? Nah, they just redid the engine and the... Whoa! Yeah, it's rough. Damn! That's wow! Rat. Yeah. That's ratchet as hell right That's there. That's rat. I, can't, I don't even know how to describe that. Go ahead. It's, it's rat. Oof. Yeah, the we kids weren't around when we built the uh, Rambler. Uh, yeah. Don't ripe, give, don't give up, Brandon. You gotta get it. Get some in your nostril. It's ripe, ain't it? <laughs> <laughs> damn. Hold up, Brandon. Uh, oh, of course. 
<laughs> it worked. <laughs> it worked. It worked. What about the that, floorboards, Chase? I don't know. Like, you wouldn't wash out with soap and water if it was worse than that. Man. That's a pretty little place you guys got here. Oh, thank you. Thank you. We're blessed. We think. We think. I suck at basketball. No gas tank. The rats took it. Yeah, the rats hauled it up. Well, if there was holes on the floor, I think we'd, I think we'd be smelling it. <laughs> we well, got a point there. Does this thing got time? Yes, it does. But uh, here, pop the hood. Let's see what all they tore apart. I know there's no gas tank in it. No gas tank. Is gas tank in it? No. Nope. Like, no, nope. not even. Power steering, power yeah. brakes, and AC. Yeah. Oh, I can smell it yeah, through there, too. Sure. Shit. I can see the tank cover back here. Yeah, it's missing the tank. It needs a carburetor and tank. Was it rusty underneath? No. Huh? How much is this $2,500 truck? <laughs> <laughs> that one ain't for sale. I'm going to restore it for my mom. Well. It's kind of rough, so I'm going to restore it. How you get that smell out? I'm going to have it re... This guy, have, he redoes it all, rips it all out, and sandblast it, and it'll come out. Well, it's rough. I know how those I'm going to restore it stories go, so you got my number. Okay. We already done good business. <laughs> yes, sir. That's I picked up out of Florida uh, from a collector. A guy had it, and he just set it in his garage. He had 16 of them, so... Is it a true black, black car? Uh, no, it was actually a silver and... Uh, it was silver with black stripes. Got it. It was the original color. Got yeah, it. And that's actually more desirable, I think, than this. Silver and, uh, with the black stripe? He, uh, he kept uh, all the motors, the originals, matching block, and AC car. Man, clean and sanitary. That's all you need right there. That's all you need. That's perfect. So the underneath looks exactly the same as that. Perfect. Where's that beer you were talking about? Let me go get it. Let's go get it. I gotta it. wash my hands from driving that, yeah, uh, that crazy thing. sticky steering. Shane, Miss Stephanie, we thank you. Yes, sir. Thank you. Go ahead on back business. to Dallas. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Well, I have a few cold beers you're driving. What do you think, man? I think it's a pretty good truck. I mean, I don't know where you're going to find a black, red, loaded. Um, with original paint. Right. I mean, it kind of sucks that they cut those front fenders, but you know, those the, are cheap enough. The hood might be able to fix, but the fender's definitely in place. But I don't know, were we just put bigger tires on it? Maybe a certain purpose? I don't know. But yeah. it's a good truck. I, I think it's a tune up away from being an everyday driver. Right. You know, that Bronco for 2500 would have been a steal, but I don't know if I wanted to clean it out or not. Well, isn't that what you hire pips for? Oh, now it's Phipps' job. <laughs> <laughs> we already went through that when we built that stupid Rambler back in like uh, one of the first couple of seasons of the show. Yeah. It smelled so bad. I mean, I didn't know anything could smell that bad. Yeah, no, no. that one was pretty bad. It was about that bad. And we had to build it. We didn't have any choice. Yeah, I'm out on that. So uh, back to the shop. We'll get this thing unloaded, get Phipps on it uh, first thing in the a.m. Just tend to give it a good once-over tune-up, check all the fluids. Okay. Don't need to go too far, it just needs to do what we need it to do. Yeah, just needs to drive, run, drive. Yeah. All right, folks, get gas. Take a little bath. Hey, Phipps, I got another POS for you. The inside of the doors are really good. Yeah, they're actually pretty solid. I like this thing, it's growing on me. I know, it's the right colors. What's up, you, man? You, you see me climbing in all these lowered ones. Well, it's not that high when you get it on the ground, it's a little lower. I'm talking about this end. Oh yeah, well, here's what we need. 
Uh, it runs and drives right now, albeit not great. So I just want to go front to back, everything electrical, everything fluids, give it a tune-up, probably need a carburetor rebuild. Uh, gas is fine, so we don't need to do anything with the tank. And uh, just give it a good clean bill of health all the way around. You're going to have approximately two hours to do that. Two hours? <laughs> I'm just kidding, but I do want to get it on the net and get it flipped. It Dude. is. Well, no, it's, it was inspected in 2018. Oh, I mean, yeah. it, it does everything it's supposed to do. It's just, did y'all uh, drive it on the trailer? Yeah. We drove it around the streets out there, too. Oh, yeah? Uh, but uh, you're going to want to get some gloves on. The steering wheel's got that sticky Dude, shit on it. Yeah. But, yeah, this, this uh, looks I mean, just solid like that truck, dude. one he got that didn't have the transmission. Yeah, it looks, like it like looks almost identical. Got. But it's a solid, solid truck except for the fenders. Yeah, that's a good one. I just don't know why it's so wavy looking. That's a shit well, ton of door dings, man. Well, it's on the other side you see Bondo. Well, that could have very well came from the factory because well, I don't think it's this not truck's too bad. Just primer. really right here, right here. It's red primer. Yeah, but I don't think the truck's been painted. No, I don't think so. There's probably a taxi at one time. Okay. So seriously, I want this thing in and out as fast as possible. Just headlights, taillights, blinkers, fluids. Don't change them yet. Let's get it running right and look at them. If they're ugly, we'll change them. They're I awesome. don't think there's any reason to do much of anything other than make sure everything works. And before we spend any big money or start digging into a rat's nest, let's make sure that it's worth it. Okay. At least it ain't yellow. Yeah. I'm tired well, of yellow things. It can be. No, it can't. No. All right. Sold new in Wichita Falls. Huh? Yeah. That's why there ain't a whole lot of rust, I guess. All right, we'll help him get it off. I'll do Get that. it inside. Give me a good bill of health. We'll get it gone. You a good bill of health? Oh, Bend I, over and cough. My health is done. <laughs>
Well, rats. Can you blow, Brandon? <laughs> I'll blow. Oh, oh my tooth big! Oh, I don't know why it backfired like that. Is that spring in the wrong place? <laughs> Now it'll work. Wishes have all come true. My friends and family are here, my lovely wife, so uh, nothing left to wish for other than peace and prosperity. Yeah. 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 Vince, I thought we were supposed to just, you know, get running good. I did, I did. So, uh, I guess the brakes were jacked up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, so um, yeah, it runs good enough to take it that next step. I mean, it really. It runs better than it. Well, everything's. Uniform. There's not a whole bunch like it had work. Right. Done. Yeah. No. It doesn't look like it's had. If yeah. It has it, had work done. It's not. It's got a lot of life left in it. Right. Yeah. It just, just break off the surface. Road. Just break. Strings. Break off. The other brakes are pretty shot. Uh, Forty-two years young. old or whatever. All right. Well. I guess order whatever we need. Just get it running, driving. I literally caked all the way through. What'd you get? I forgot how to make it go faster. So normally under that would be a bunch of rust, but it's solid. It's pretty solid back there, which is phenomenal. So I'll take that any day. What is that, Vic? We got brake lines, brake shoes, wheel spinners. Oh, I thought it was Richard's uh, mash cylinder. birthday present. If I get it running today. What tools up, Vic? Spanner. Bolt or nut wrench, I guess, socket. What does it do? Okay, on the four wheel drive where the axle, this is what turn makes it four wheel drive. Uh huh. So to have that shaft coming through, you gotta do the brakes different or the hub. Hold the hub on. Gotcha. Google it. That, that, those two things right there, the master cylinder and the other side. Good. Uh, we need to service everything after we know that we got brakes that we want. And uh, we might ought to go ahead and order a set of shocks all around, I don't know. Well, uh, I was gonna hot seat it underneath, if, if I can get to it. Uh, and it, it it'll not be some of the time. Well, you know what I'd rather do, possibly? is uh, get that dry ice guy to come out here. Well, that would, uh, this would be a plus. This would be a... It's supposed to be really, really rad. Uh, that could be real cool. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Well, let's not okay, waste so any time what, on what, what we're going to clean or what we're going to do until we know we got a good running dry yeah, ice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it, it, it's Just that simple, boys and girls. After three weeks, many trips to the psychiatrist, we're done. Now, we've got new brakes, all except for drums. They weren't nothing wrong with those. Uh, rotors, calipers, lines, master cylinder. Should last another 40 years or whatever. Uh, it runs great. Or did sitting here idling. After uh, they take a couple pictures underneath it, there's already some people interested in it. Uh, we're gonna roll it out. It's loud. Just went through all the gears.
it's close to noon. So what's up everybody? If you've been watching along as we just kind of went through the blazer front to back, everything works. We put new brakes on it, uh, changed all the fluids. Uh, it's a nice driving good little vehicle now. Uh, what I think is uh, the coolest thing about this vehicle is it's from the factory black, red interior, and the removable top should be white. That would have been a sexy, sexy truck in 1980. So uh, really pretty much rust-free truck, super nice needs to be restored or driven as is it's for sale right now gasmonkeygarage.com check it out first one here with cash gets Woo! 